The brain relies heavily on carbohydrates to fuel neural activity during exercise, but it's not necessarily all coming from blood glucose. In fact, the brain can store significant amounts of glycogen that are used to generate lactate during exercise. So lactate's actually an important fuel source for the brain during exercise, and the brain becomes a consumer of lactate during exercise, particularly um, the high intensity strenuous exercise. And this is thought to contribute to those energy demands. So unfortunately, the brain can't oxidize large amounts of fat, and fatty acids aren't transported and oxidized efficiently within the brain. The brain can oxidize ketones uh, that are generated by the liver, during periods of starvation and fasting, but there's some doubt as to whether these can meet the full energy requirements and energetic capacity required for high intensity or strenuous exercise.